Hey everybody, welcome back to Raven Hot Coins. And guys, today we have a bank bag of nickels. Instead of a box, we're doing $200 worth. So we're going to open this bad boy up, see what we find. Hopefully, we get some good stuff. I think so with this many nickels, but you never know. And to give you an idea, there is a mix. You have brand new nickels, it looks like. But then I see way here in the back. Let me get to it real quick. I apologize, guys. Customer wrapped. So we're going to get together our nickel mids. Ten of them. And see what we find. If we have any obvious enders, we'll open those live on film. If not, we will return. Raven Hot Coins. Stay tuned. Hey everybody, welcome back to Raven Hawk Coins, and we have our nickel mids together. Looks like we are shorted one roll, but uh, it's quite a mix. It looks like there's a lot of new nickels in here, so we might get through this kind of quick, but you never know. I may just be assuming, and uh, we'll see what we find. Raven Hawk Coins, stay tuned. Hey everybody, welcome back to Raven Hawk Coins. We got through the first nickel mid, guys, and it was all... 2018 D's but this was a really really nice one um, looks like he has a tiny little ding just above his eye that I just caught in the camera I'm not gonna keep it but I figured I'd uh, show you guys that the first of the nickel mids was just brand new so we'll get into the next one and see what we find Raven hot coins stay tuned hey everybody welcome back to Raven hot coins guys we got through the next nickel mid and it was all brand new but this next one should have something older hopefully we'll see i know it has some uh, customer wrapped so we might get one or two but so far this is not turning out to be what i thought it would but hey you can't win them all raven hot coins stay tuned hey everybody welcome back to raven hot coins we got through the next nickel mid i knew there was going to be something at least older than 2018 finally here's what we found we got Dun, 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 dun. 2009 Denver two of them really cool decent shape then this really cool 1973 you can see where the Denver right here is basically touching his collar I like the off uh, these were hand punched back in the day so when they're that far off I keep them I have one that's really, really high on the collar that's probably worth quite a bit. I just haven't uh, tried to get rid of it, but there was a bounty on that coin at some point. Let's see here. And this one, the last one's a 1940 Philly. We're going to get into the next one, guys. A um, lot of new stuff, so we'll see if we find anything. And uh, we'll go from there. Raven Hawk Coins, stay tuned. Hey, everybody. Welcome back to Raven Hawk Coins. We got through the next of the nickel mids, guys. We got some decent finds. First of all, we have a 1959. Let me get this focused in a little better. This one's a 59. It's a Denver. Then we got war. <laughs> Nickel. Yeah, guys, a 45 Philly. I'm actually really shocked that that came out of one of the rolls because... This has been mostly brand new nickels. And then another 1942, but this one is again, uh, looks like it's a non, non war nickel, non silver. But hey, anytime you find silver, it's a good day. We got five more to get through. Raven Hot Coins, stay tuned. Hey, everybody, welcome back to Raven Hot Coins. And guys, I messed up my count, we had six left. Uh, we got through the next one. No fines. All brand new. Hopefully we get some more good stuff. So far, I really still can't complain. Raven Hot Coins, stay tuned. Hey, everybody. Welcome back to Raven Hot Coins. We got through the next nickel mid, guys. And again, no fines. All brand new. I know we got some good ones. Well, not good ones as far as uh, what's in them because I don't know what's there. But we do have some circulated rolls coming up. In these last uh, four, because I had seen some enders that were older, but not anything obvious. So hopefully, we'll get something out of there. Raven Hot Coins, stay tuned. Hey everybody, welcome back to Raven Hot Coins. We've got through the next of the nickel mids. Mostly new again, guys, but we did find this 1970 
Denver Black Beauty. And this sucker is dark. Pretty cool. We got three more to go. Hope you find something good. Raven Hot Coins, stay tuned. Hey everybody, welcome back to Raven Hot Coins. Look at the massive amounts of empty rolls. We have one find. And uh, I'm happy with it though. Another 2009 Denver, guys. I am literally killing it with the 2009s in this area. It's been good to me. And uh, anybody looking for a roll of 2009s, let me know. <laughs> Ravenhawk Coins, stay tuned. Hey, everybody. Welcome back to Ravenhawk Coins. We've got through the second to the last of the nickel mids. We have some really, really cool finds. To give you an idea, let's look at this one here. This is a 2000 Denver. Gorgeous shape. And uh, full steps, guys. I looked at this under my jeweler's loop, and it has full steps. He brought a buddy to the, the game from 98 with the same. And I have a new scope courtesy of VC Coins Nevada. So I am going to probably make a video here in the next couple days uh, just highlighting exactly what. Um, oh, yeah, this is a 53 San Francisco. Uh, what Full Steps is and why it is so coveted. Um, I'm going to show you the PCGS, PCGS price guide and break down the reason why you want to look for everything. Then our last but last least, not least is a 38 Philly, so not too bad for a bag that was mostly brand new. We have gotten some decent finds. We got one more nickel mid. Let's see what we get. Raven Hot Coins, stay tuned. Hey everybody, welcome back to Raven Hot Coins. We finally got through the 20th nickel mid. Is it 20? No, 10. The 10th one. Oh my goodness. Wait, five, ten. Yeah, yeah, ten. <laughs> Sorry about that, guys. I don't know why I messed up my math there for a second. I guess it was because it's was $200. But uh, here's the last of our finds. We found more 2009 Denvers, guys. Two more of these bad boys. Really, really happy. That makes five total in the box. Then we got a 1954 Denver. Last but not least, a 1946 and uh, I'm not sure if it's got a mint mark. Nope, it's a Philly. So guys, we got five 2009s. A couple of full step nickels that I'm going to do a video on here soon. The 1945 Philly War huh. Nickel. That little P right there makes me a happy boy. Alright guys, well... Make the moral of the story here is even if you get a bag full of brand new ones, look at every coin because you never know what you're going to find. I did not expect the war nickel whatsoever, nor did I expect the full steps or the amount of 2009s I got. So um, hopefully I can do this again and next time it's a lot more circulated so that we get some uh, more variety on the table as far as numbers. But still can't complain, guys. Can't always hit a grand slam, but this isn't bad. So if you want to correspond, it's ravenhotcoins at gmail.com. Our P.O. Box is 721296, Norman, Oklahoma, 73070. Make sure you support all the channels out there, and definitely make sure you take care of one another. Ravenhot Coins, have a great day!